Uh, yeah, then let's continue a little bit with the, 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 after this examples with EMC work. Maybe you have seen this slide also already. M maybe, maybe not. Okay. So this slide, the message of this slide is just the following. Um, so imagine you are developing a product like some medical engineering product, some control system for car, um, any, any product, then you usually, you develop it. At the end of the development, you have a prototype, then you go into testing, then you have, let's say, like a final prototype sample, and then you go into production. And the, the possibilities that you have for improving your product in terms of EMC they will go down over time because during the development phase, you can change something, the layout on a printed circuit board easily. You can, you can select different components. You can, um, I don't know, have a different case that offers some shielding, something like this. You can uh, arrange the cables, lay out the cables in a different way. So here you have lots of chances for improvement. Um, and Typically, you can do these improvements for very small costs because if you change the layout of the printed circuit board, the, the production cost, the later production cost for the printed circuit board will remain the same. Um, so, yeah, you have many chances for improvement, low cost. If you go into testing, you already have less chances for improvement, and if you do improvements, they will go with, go on in, with larger cost. And if you go into the production phase, the only thing that you can maybe do is you can um, yeah, send a filter to each of your customer that will make the product EMC compliant. And if you have to do this, and if you have already sold a uh, thousand units or so, then you will have to ship another thousand filters to each of your customers, and this will be very costly. So the, the main message of this um, of the slide is. EMC is not something additional that you later on add to the product, like you, you cook something and you, you add the secret sauce at the end. Right? It's, it's an ingredient that you really need to, uh, to put into the product from the early beginning. It's not something that you can let, add later on. But often and sometimes in companies, it's done in the way that um, yeah, people think, okay, let's develop a product and EMC is something that we will take care of later on. And this is not the way it works because you, you, you don't have that many options uh, and you will have very strong costs.